what's going on guys welcome back to my channel so today Devin and I we're headed to Portland Oregon right now are you gonna tell me what it's called carshow.com car.com what is it called Tuner Evo Tuner Revolution Whoa. down to Portland, Oregon right now and we're in Devon's Evo. We're about six and a half-ish hours away and we're headed to Tuner Evolution. I personally have never been. Have you been? It's the first year. Yeah. Oh, in, ever? In Portland, yeah. Oh, first year ever in Portland. So I hope some of you guys are going to be down there. Uh, I know we're going to meet a lot of people this weekend. So he's meeting up with Dustin William and I'm still really really sick this is going on the second week of being sick it's so stupid Devin just it's so stupid Devin just stopped by the store and we got cough drops tissues I picked up some Advil and I got the Gatorade so hopefully by the time we get down there I might be feeling a little bit better if you drink beer you'd be better because beer has stuff in it to make you healthy Washington and I will update you guys when we get a little bit closer to Portland, Oregon. What's up guys? We are about 20 minutes outside of Portland and it started raining here. The weather was like super super nice when we first went through freaking Washington and Oregon but now it's crappy. We pulled over with the beautiful Evo and the beautiful red wheels. We have Devin taking some pictures. We're right here on a beautiful river. I think that's the George Columbus River. And yeah, we're just hanging out. Yeah, hot. So yeah, I will update you guys when we get closer to Portland, we're but I'm I'm really, really trying to get Devin to take me to Chick-fil-A. It's my all-time favorite. Quick correction, it's not Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A. <laughs> We made it to Portland, Oregon, and we actually decided instead of staying in Portland, Oregon, we're actually gonna drive an hour straight west. West. Straight west to Seaside, Oregon and stay for the night. Devin and I went there probably about three years ago when we first started dating. So we will see you guys either at Chick-fil-A, because I've still been a, I've been asking for about a million hours now, or in Seaside, Oregon. They don't, they, guys, they don't have one of these in Spokane. So whenever we're in California or Seattle or Portland or really anywhere other than Spokane, we always get Chick-fil-A. It's a sad day. Should we open a Chick-fil-A in Spokane? Yes. Just for you? Just for me so I can eat there every day. I would eat there every day. I know. So I'm still dieting, you guys. And I've already, I shouldn't say I've already hit my goal because I didn't really have a goal. I just wanted to get as low as I could until I felt like it was a good weight. This morning was my lowest weigh in at 126.6. So I'm still so dieting. You got fries. I did get fries. And I got grilled chicken. And I've saved a lot of calories. Oh, we're not on the, on the top. Oh. It's okay. Mm. I was gonna, I was gonna say that seems like really low to have to be on the top floor. That's definitely the crow's neck up there. You could say the crow's neck. Yeah. Or nest. Is that what it's called? <laughs> the crow's neck, definitely. <laughs> oh wow, it's a studio. Cute. Cute little kitchen. Ah. Oh. What do you think? I can see Devin already likes it a lot. I totally am. <laughs> Cute. Where is the nightlife at? This light up here? <laughs> that little light? It's a pizza place. That's the nightlife here. It is? It's awfully quiet for Friday. We found our bar of choice. By the way, I changed because I look like crap before. Crap? Yeah, crap. Thank you. Dry apple? Very dry. I don't know how my throat would like that. Oh, that's fire. Give me. So I know this is super 
super irrelevant. Focus. Super irrelevant because I've been eating kind of like crap this whole entire trip. But when I'm dieting, I like to do Moscow mules just because a little tidbit of a fact. Ginger beer. Is, bit of a fact. <laughs> ginger beer is low in calories and same with vodka. Kinda, if you want to drink. So, ginger beer and vodka, and leave out the lime. Why? I don't know. Couldn't tell ya. You know, the funny thing is, Devin and I were here three years ago. Back when I was 20 years old, now I'm 23. I had blonde hair, and Devin and I had just been dating for June, for three months. Three months. And now look, we're back. Morning, guys. Just woke up and it's about eight o'clock ish woo in the morning it's actually really kind of crappy outside this morning but i'll kind of show you what it looks like out here the ocean is over that way that's where devin and i were at last night is down that in that area devin and i are going to head down stairs and get some breakfast this morning and coffee because finally I can feel that my voice is getting better and my cough is slowly going away so I can have a nice cup of joe and not have it hurt my throat. Are you ready baby? No I'm sick. No you're not sick you're fine. So guys Devin and I figured something out last night. When we were pulling inside to this parking lot it looked super familiar to us. Here we've been in Seaside before the about three years ago and Devin and I realized that we actually, uh, it's a really long story, I don't know how to explain it. This is it. the fastest story ever. We are here, and I parked my truck here, and we slept in this parking lot. In the end, truck. End of story. We slept in this parking lot in the truck. That's crazy, huh? Because we couldn't find a hotel the last time that we were here, it was so packed. So we actually had to just sleep inside of his truck. And we realized that it's the same parking lot that we slept in. And now we're here. It's just ironic. The irony. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Bobby Wallace. I'm a social media influencer slash um, model, and I'm I'm cool. I'm really cool too. And my boyfriend wishes he was as cool as me. <laughs> Facts. What's up, guys? Devin and I just got done walking around Seaside, Oregon. We're about an hour and a half outside of Portland, which is where we need to go right now. And I apologize, I didn't take the camera with me just because I thought we were walking down to the beach and it's gonna have like a cool 10 minute walk, but instead we went to get coffee, we went to the beach, and we went to the Big Kahuna. so far I will keep you guys posted as soon as we get back into Portland guys just because this is kind of it okay so what I like to so what I like to define my YouTube channel is is literally life yeah that is my YouTube I literally just vlog my life and it's literally a like, little bit of everything. Like, I think the way you should define it is like being a real human. Yeah. Because a lot of people don't, even myself. Like, I don't. Like, I'm not a real, I don't, I don't vlog myself being a person. I vlog myself as cars and that's it. And that's it. And a lot of, like, especially in the fitness industry, nobody really vlogs as like, except for like brand yeah. Nobody vlogs as a being like a human, like the, the shit you have to go through to get to a certain point, like in your physical appearance. So, I just want to share a little background with you guys. And I'm all of my feels right now because if you guys have been following, 
following me I have almost like 80 I think it's like almost 80 videos in on my whole really yeah. almost 200 videos on my YouTube if you guys go back way to the start and watch up until now you guys will know that I have been through the ringer with dieting with cutting with freaking living my life I've gone through stages um, of I don't know I've just gone through stages throughout this ups and downs, ups and, downs and you can tell if you're on my YouTube videos I will honestly say if you guys have watched the last three or four YouTube videos that I posted you guys know that I am dieting and I have so far lost about 13 to I would say I've lost about 15 pounds and this has been the absolute slowest process of my whole entire late weight loss process usually I will diet I will stick to that diet I act like I am going to do a show I count every single macro that goes into my body um, and then once I stop dieting, I will inhale on every single ty type of food there is that I've been craving and I will gain all that weight back by the time a month is up and I'm back to a heavy weight. Throughout this last diet, I have been very good with my macros, but I have been slowly doing it. So I will hit my macros, but if there's one day in the week that I feel like I want to have a cheat meal then I will I'll freaking have it and I'll be very cautious about what I eat I won't make sure I'm like super super stuffed and full but I will I'll still do it and I like just now I went and had a mimosa and I had breakfast this morning with Devin and I didn't track any of that shit and I just posted something on Instagram that just said there like a, there's a balance and I've slowly, slowly yet surely have been learning there's a balance in life. Um, and obviously if I was going to do a show I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be eating like this. But I'm not. So, guys, if this is you and you're trying to lose weight, don't beat yourself up about having one cheat meal. That doesn't mean that you can have a cheat meal and just give up. That means have a cheat meal and work your ass off the next day. If you follow me on Instagram, I do post a lot of like bikini shit. I post a lot of stuff where my body might look really, really good to some of you. And I'm just telling you, that's not the reality of things. That's not what life is all about. guys 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 we made it to portland we are inside this place where the car show is gonna be devin is parking his car with dustin williams and yeah the show's not until tomorrow so we're parking devin's car in here and then we're gonna meet a couple of his <coughs> friends and um and hang out and hang check, out check out sick cars to meet meet all you guys that came out i'm freaking pumped to meet you guys for real I'll probably have anxiety tomorrow like I always do. Yeah. I get that worst anxiety when I meet like homies or fans or family, whatever you want to call But this is what I have to do to make him feel better. I made it worse. Oh. <laughs> Alright, but yeah, I'm excited to see some of you guys. I'll catch you guys when things get exciting. Later that same evening. It's a little baby. Oh it's such a little baby camera. Is that Wally Wallace? Wallace? Is that Wally Wallace? <laughs> <laughs> What's up guys? 
Jordan here, or three cities. I took the Bobby vlog cam for the moment. Um, really watching my macros at the moment. Today, we're gonna be, ooh. Oh God, I almost fucking fell. Just kidding, Bobby, I love you. Hello. We just made it to Tuner Evo, guys, and it's just getting started. Devin and I have been walking around for about, I don't know, 30 minutes. And the show hasn't even started yet, and there's a lot of freaking people here. So, there's this room right here, and then you come over here, and then there's this room over here. Okay, there's one car here that I really, really like. Well, I like a lot of the cars, but it's a Genesis. Wide-bodied, so let me know your opinion on what you think. So, blah. blah. Obviously, I have these headlights, but mine are black. I like the hood. I like the wide body. And then these are the tail the newer tail lights that they came out with for the Genesis. They're already leaking in this car though, but I've always always really wanted a, a duck bill like this. This is the main part, so I don't know, I think this looks really good. You like those wheels on here? Yeah. So this is like one of my favorite cars so far. Devin and I haven't really got the chance to walk around and look at all of them. And I like a lot of these cars. So I'm gonna just pick like one car that I really, really like and show you guys. So we're here at my favorite car. Um, we haven't even looked at all the cars yet, but I wanna say this is like already my favorite car. So let me take a freaking look. Let's be real, the only, only reason she thinks it's a favorite car is because it's my favorite car. That's the only reason. You gotta tell them what it is. Porsche. Porsche what? Uh, IX72599. Good job. Yeah. But it's I, got a Panda kit on it. I really like the color and everything about it is just kind of minty. Do you like the wide body kit? Yeah, I like everything. I like the Genesis so far in this car. The absolute. So I told you guys that I would vlog at the end of the show, and honestly, I completely forgot because. Devin and I kind of just hung out inside of a buddy's car for a while and then, yeah, Devin pretty much fell asleep. And by that point, it was the car awards and then by that point, we were already gone. So, we're here still in Portland, Oregon. It's raining and I don't have a hood, so I'm just getting soaked right now. But we are gonna get some food because I'm hungry slash hangry. Devin's just chilling. <laughs> We got the Evo. We're just trying to figure out where to go. We're trying to, we, when we're out of town, we try to go places that we've never been before or that aren't in Spokane. So, Mamma Mia's. Mamma Mia, Mamma Mia, Mamma Mia. Buffalo Wild Wings, which is my choice because I love me some BWWs. Thank you. <laughs> what? Hey, yes, hi. <laughs> Make sure you put your towel in your lap. I already did, huh? Yeah. Hey guys, so I am back home. I apologize. I thought I got more than that. The camera stopped recording at that last clip. So I am back home in Spokane, Washington, and I just want to give a big thank you to everybody who showed up to the car show. I met some amazing people, Devin and I both. We are so grateful. Um, I appreciate it, and there's going to be a lot more events that we're going to go to this year. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and remember to hit that subscribe button. Remember to hit that thumbs up button just to let me know that you like these videos and you want to see more of me literally just vlogging, and it was a super long video. So if you made it to the end, just give it a thumbs up and let me know. So I appreciate it, guys. Appreciate you, and um, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.